Hey everyone, this is Mukesh Shutwani once again from learn-ambition.com. Today in this video, I'm going to talk about a very frequently asked question that how much time it takes to learn Selenium. Okay, so first of all, it depends on so many factors. So let me give my opinion. Okay, so let me know your thoughts on the thing. Let me know in the comment section or via email. Okay, so let me uh, talk about why do you want to learn Selenium. So chances are maybe you are you are a manual tester or maybe you want you know career growth or maybe you want to you know upgrade yourself so you are learning automation right so at the end of the day you will be attending interviews that is the one part second part maybe you are coming from a different uh, profiles maybe you, are, you have been into development or you have been to support or maybe you are into some other field now you want to come into the testing part and now you want to you know learn automation so depends on how much what is your intention i mean to say okay so if your intention is that you want to only you know learn for the sake of interviews then you have a different uh, you know path but if you want to you know be the expert in automation then definitely you have a different path so let me uh, you know tell you how much time it takes to you know uh, just to crack interviews and how much time it will take to excel in this particular field so let me take the first part okay so let's say you are into manual testing now you want to come into the automation so if you want to start everything from the scratch okay so first of all you have to learn at least one of the programming language i will say java or python or java script or you know depends on which programming language you want to choose second part will be that you have to learn selenium now selenium is just a small library for web automation right but along with selenium you will be also you know learning different tools like you will be learning test ng library or junit then you will be learning git github jenkins apache py how to read configuration how to create framework how to you know integrate all of them and create a concrete framework with selenium thread so there is a lot of tools or i will say libraries that you you need to learn when you uh, jump from manual to automation so if i conclude that how much time it takes i will um, tell you approximately it takes 40 to 45 hours okay if you want to cover all of this which i discussed just now i'm talking about the number of hours okay number not number of days so it totally depends how much time you are devoting per day to automation let's say you are just sitting one hour uh, daily to learn then within 45 days you will understand selenium and the different tools that we integrate and the basic framework okay framework it's a i will say a long term commitment it takes time to build the framework so i will not say that you will be master after 45 days but at least after 45 days you will have enough knowledge that how automation works from the scratch till the end now comes your practice time suppose now you are devoting every day 2 hours for the practice okay then again um, let's say you are again practicing for 30 days okay so at that will be around 60 hours so practice uh, definitely you need to do because if you don't do the practice if you don't implement from your side then you will not be able to crack interviews because learning is different part because as a trainer when i teach something it looks very easy okay because i have been doing the uh, same thing from a long time so i know the syntax i remember the syntax you know i have i know what kind of challenges you might face i know what kind of exception you will face so uh, i can fix it very quickly but the moment you start working you will face lot of challenges so until you don't practice you will not be able to crack interviews okay so first 45 hours to learn this then i will say again minimum 60 hours for the practice approximately i will say 105 or let's say 100 hours so 3 months is enough okay if you are planning from manual to automation but again depends you know your learning curve let's say you are very slow learner you take things you take some time to grab all these things so it's okay you might extend to 4 months or maybe 5 to 6 months but if you are a quick learner then yeah within 3 months you can easily switch from manual to automation okay i'm just talking about you can switch but what if you have to excel okay then there's no time constraint every day you have to learn new things new technologies new tools new libraries okay you have to start automating different projects maybe you can start implementing different projects from your uh, company or you can you know do some kind of freelancing work where you will get a chance to work with different applications which is not in your company right so the more applications you will be automating the more knowledge you will be getting so that is my whole point okay first part let's take minimum 90 days minimum i was at 3 months uh, i'm assuming you are working like so you are spending 1 hour 2 hours on you know learning and when it comes to building or you know getting expertise there's no time constraint i'm still learning and i am st- learning different tools technology which can be integrated with automation 
and again automation does not fall into web automation right we have different categories of automation web automation ap automation we have mobile automation then we have desktop automation and again when it comes to non function we have a different set of tools so this will take some time but yes uh 90 days to 180 days is enough because the reason why i'm saying 180 days because the moment you start giving interviews right they will not only ask you selenium or the respective to tools they will also ask you related to let's see your manual testing questions agile related questions jira related questions they will be asking some java related interview questions like uh, find out the duplicate element from the array count the how many numbers are getting repeated so there are a lot of preparation you have to do if you have to switch from manual to automation but yes if you are serious about your career if you are sitting one hour or two hours in a day within 3 to 6 months you will be able to crack interviews now i want some help from you that in case you have followed the same thing which i mentioned and still if you are not able to crack interviews then let me know in the comment section i will help you that what is missing from your end because what i think if you are following the proper path then you should be able to crack the interviews but in case if you are not able to it means something is wrong from your end it could be because you are not able to understand the interviewer mind or maybe you are able to understand the question but you are not able to answer it properly so whatever your doubts are whatever kind of challenges that you have faced in your recent interviews let me know in the in the comment section and i will try my best to answer all of them and the second part guys keep learning keep automating and um, you know everything is available now stack overflow quora lot of youtube videos blog so i don't think you will stuck somewhere but still if you face uh, any other challenges okay which are not able to fix from your end let me know i will also give a try from my end and let's see how it goes that's all from my side i hope this video help you in certain manner if yes then do subscribe this channel share with your colleagues or friends who are planning to switch from manual to automation and i will see you in the next video have a nice day bye bye